directly support him. From what we've heard, many fans have already let it go and are more worried about the pitching rotation. Brett Beganski at Miller Park talking to those fans who really they've been there for days now. They let them inside. They're about to get tickets and it is seems like just a giant party. Oh, it's a giant party, and you're worried about the pitching rotation. Right now, they're worried about getting a rally towel from Bernie Brewer. He just uh, is gracing us with his current presence. I'll tell you one thing. I was off camera with him. He's so understanding. He's such a good listener. He's a good guy to have around, ladies. Well, one guy right here who's so close with the Brewers, two-time All-Star Larry Heisel, close to the situation. You've been around the organization for all these years. People waiting outside for tickets in the cold. Is, is it a little different from the old county stadium days to today with people in the snow? There's a little difference, but the commitment, the dedication has never changed. My first year in 1978, we drew 1.6 million people, which we thought was phenomenal. For this market to draw, which they will again this year, over 3 million people, it's just hard to comprehend, but we're blessed with fans like no other. They were talking a few reports about how Milwaukee Brewers are one of the best selling teams right now for opening day, and they were saying fans are outside, they're intense, there's snow on the ground, but they're dedicated, they're waiting outside. I'll bet the big reason, of course, is Ryan Braun. Without a question, uh, we're really blessed. The fans that will see this young man play will see a player that comes along once every maybe 20, 30 years. What he's done already is what most players will accomplish in a, a complete career. Uh, he's truly one of the best. You know, he's had some circumstances that he's had to deal with. He's had Hall of Fame numbers already. Many people have argued his reputation will not be the same. Your thoughts on that? Will he ever get back to that status of um, having that squeaky clean image? I think so. I think anyone that's met Ryan, and I've had the privilege to talk to Ryan on numerous occasions, uh, I mentor at risk youth and will bring them to the ballpark for batting practice. Ryan Braun, without question, will come over at least 80% of the time and say something so encouraging that when we're going home, that young man will say, Mr. Heisel, this is the best day of my life. He is not only one of the greatest players, but one of the nicest I've been around. Larry Heisel, all-star, Brewers legend right here. Thank you. Well, I'll tell you what, everybody's happy because not only Braun's here, but the ticket box is going to be opening in just a few minutes. So thank you to everybody here at Miller Park. Thank you to Larry Heisel. Time for baseball. April 2012. I love it. How many times is Larry surrounded by this many uh, drinks and people drinking just, uh, you know, those early morning cocktails? He's seen, he's seen his fair <laughs> share, but I'll tell you one thing. Uh, Larry, I'm not going to ask him his age, even though I know this, but uh, <laughs> he actually keeps a very healthy lifestyle. So the guy, you know what, he could still go out there and play uh, outfield for the Brewers right now. I guarantee it. And the mood, Brett, just there with people waiting for their tickets. It's, everyone just seems they've been waiting for days. The anticipation, the moment is near. They're trying to get the uh, sensation back into their uh, fingertips and their, <laughs> and their toes, but uh, they always say it'll be worth it once they have the tickets in hand, once they have their uh, four tickets in hand for opening day on Good Friday, as you heard uh, one woman say, it's going to be all worth it. All right. Thanks, Brett. Brett hanging out at the park today.